Yeah, uh, it's what we talked about yesterday. Um, you know, playing a simple game and being hard on their, de uh, their defense and, and using our speed to our advantage. I, I think as uh, the game went on, we wore them down. And uh, it's, it's a long series. And we just got to, shift by shift, just do that every single uh, every single night. Frank, like you were we talked more. about downhill in the offensive zone. You were caught at least 40 shots or so. And you should have wanted to get some pucks on those two goalies. Yeah, I think that's the goal all, uh, all along. And no matter who's in that or what team we're playing against, is we want to produce, uh, you know, from uh, make plays from behind the goal line and uh, not force it, but that's what we work on. And um, I think we did a good job of that tonight of uh, creating second chances also. Frank, the, the, you, put, you talked before how since the time that you've been here, you've noticed the resiliency of the group. Doing it in the playoffs, though, like what do you think that does for the locker room to, to prove that you can not only do it in the regular season, but you can do it on a stage like this? Yeah, it's, it's big. Um, you know, playoff hockey is a different animal, and everyone's got to step up their game. You know, a few percent. Um, you know, obviously the first ten minutes of every game is very high intense, and there's there's gonna be momentum swings no matter who you're playing against, and throughout the whole entire uh, series. So you gotta learn how to weather those, and when you get the momentum shifts, you make sure you're bearing down your chances. And I think that's what we did tonight. How special was Eli first couple minutes I can't say enough about him. He's been great uh, the entire year, and uh, to have the confidence in that goaltender and knowing if there's a breakdown that he's gonna be there to uh, to bail you out. Yeah, uh, we talk about it. Everyone needs to be going every single night. It's the playoffs. Uh, if you're on the first line, the fourth line, whatever line you're on or whatever deep pairing you're on, no matter how many minutes you're playing, we need we need big minutes that are, you know, whatever minutes that you're playing, we need the most that you can get out of every single guy. And um, that's important. Uh, we have the depth on this team to score goals and uh, to shut it down defensively. So it's it's great to see uh, everyone getting involved. Frank, what did you do personally to contribute the way you did tonight? It was great. Um, you know, obviously, uh, Crides gets a good stick on the other one, and Brad makes a great play off the wall, and uh, my shot just ended up going in the net. But, you know, um, it just feels a lot better uh, contributing to the win. And, uh, you know, we got a few more wins to go, and uh, we just focus on the next game now. I think there's always room for improvement. You can't be too complacent with how your game went, and I think you take the positives out of games. and. Um, there's there's going to be some not negative. I want to say negatives, but things you kind of have to work on. And I think we should just bear down a little bit more in our D zone and, and look at the film and see what we need to do to close down some scoring chances. What kind of lift did you get in the crowd tonight? The crowd's been great. Uh, regular season since I've been here and uh, the playoffs, they bring it to a whole another level, and it, it definitely gives us that boost out there. Uh, I think the best fans in the league. It's great.